Shocking truth revealed. Should a woman become a pastor? Point number one, spiritual order. Please note that the first female was not made from dust, but was made from a curved chamber taken from male Adam. Therefore, from the beginning, it is clear that the woman's existence came from the man. Her splendor is from the man. In Genesis chapter 3 verse 16, our Heavenly Father said to the woman that her husband is her authority. Hence, he shall rule over her. She should therefore not usurp the authority of the man in any way, as the man was first formed, not her. And the man was not deceived, but her. Therefore, any woman who believes that she is the leader of her husband or household is a woman who is walking disorderly. The same can be said for any woman who believes that she is the leader of the household of our Heavenly Father. Our Heavenly Father has already set His house in His order from the beginning. Point number two, the right to rule. Having and possessing the right to rule is the authority our Heavenly Father entrusted to the male man. Man was made and placed here on earth to represent our Heavenly Father. Being born male means that you were born a leader. You must remain in submission to the words of our Heavenly Father. Being born female means that you were born to help the male in fulfilling his purpose. His purpose is to serve our Heavenly Father not only in spirit, but most certainly in truth. When she helps him to fulfill his purpose, her purpose will be fulfilled.